Hello everyone, my name is Jessica and I am back with another Bibbidi unboxing and I'm so excited because this box is huge. Um, for my subscribers, uh, welcome back and if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. I do a lot of Disney unboxings, I also do Harry Potter, Star Wars. Uh, mostly Bibbidi so far, but I have a couple other boxes that I ordered quite a while ago. Just still waiting for them to come to try out. Uh, I have a Mickey Loot and Be Our Guest Express coming. So as soon as those come, I'll be doing an unboxing of those. And I also like to do shopping hauls and just uh, Disney videos in general. So if you're into that sort of thing, hit subscribe down below. So with no further ado, let's get into this Bibbidi box. So this month I did the Ultimate Magic Box, which is $119. Um, if you're not into Disney, they also have Star Wars, Marvel, Harry Potter. They have price points all the way from $9.99, which is their Sparkle Box, all the way up to the Ultimate Magic Box. So lots of options to fit your price range. And if you're unfamiliar, you go and you fill out a huge preference sheet and they have a wish list, so you're pretty much guaranteed to get items that you like as long as you fill all those things out. So it's a very quick overview, but I'm excited to want to get into this box. So, give you guys the first look. Ta -da! The bags are back! Yay! <laughs> Uh, so last month there was a delay in shipping with the bags coming back, so they were back to the paper confetti, which is fine. I just care what's inside, really. Um, but I do love the bags, so I'm excited to see those back. Um, so the card, everybody's got a laugh in place, <clears throat> and I love Splash Mountain. So I'm so happy I got this card, because last month I just got the packing slip. Um, they didn't have the card dead either, so... Very excited to have this. It's got splash on the inside. There's our packing slip, which we will save, and the logo on the bottom. And this is one I'm definitely going to frame because I love Splash Mountain. All right, so let's get the bag out here. So this time we got the iridescent bag, and these bags are awesome. They're huge, they got handles, they got the drawstring. Um, I actually use these over Lent, uh, which sounds weird, but a friend of mine posted on Facebook, you know, instead of giving up something, take an, out of, an item out of your closet each day to donate to charity. So I have three Bibbidi bags full um, of 40 plus items of clothing, because I threw a few extras in there, um, to donate to charity. Um, I don't always give up something for Lent, but... I saw that and I thought, this is a great idea, I need to get rid of some stuff anyway. And so it was kind of a motivator for me to go through my closet. So anyway, random thought, let's get into this bag. I like to be surprised, so I'm just going to reach in. Ooh, that's one big item, so I want to save that. Oh, let's do this first. A shirt. Oh, how cute. Is that the back? Oh, no, it's just folded weird. Let me straighten it out. So this is official Ice Master of Arendelle. And it's got Kristoff and Sven on there in the castle. I did put on my preferences that I love Frozen and Frozen 2, um, especially Kristoff. So I am super excited for this. I love this. And I don't have this shirt yet, so this will definitely be going in the suitcase next time we go to the parks. Awesome. <laughs> next we have a little white box, which means a Lillian and Co. Ooh, and I like the purple bag. They usually come with pink. But purple is my favorite color, so excited about that. It's a really light purple. It's probably hard to tell on the camera, but I used those last time for um, to put my jewelry and stuff in, so that worked really good. 
Oh, this was on my wish list. Oh, this is awesome. So it's a necklace this time. I have quite a few bracelets, but this one's a necklace. And it says, here's to the next 30,000 years on Spaceship Earth. Another one of my favorite rides. I'll try to get it in there. It's hard to see with the, the glare. I love Spaceship Earth, and I'm so excited that I got to ride it a few more times before they change it, if they're going to change it. I feel like it's a little bit up in the air. Um, now, all Lillian and Co's will come with a little card kind of describing, and then care instructions on the back. So this one says, Humanity. It's been a slow and steady growth for us. We've evolved and expanded, but it's only the beginning. Here's to the next 30,000 years on Spaceship Earth. So this is awesome. I'm gonna hang these next to my other ones that I have by my mirror. And I'm so excited to have my first Lillian & Co necklace. This is awesome. Yay! All right, and the, I think this is gonna be the last thing and it's a very big item. I'll make sure nothing else fell to the bottom. Yeah, this should be it. I've been wanting this bag for so long. I didn't put a lot of items on my wish list, specifically hoping that I would get this bag. And they they got the hint. <laughs> I don't need my scissors. It's very well packaged. This is the Rapunzel bag. So you can see they got the lanterns. This is embroidered on really nice. And this is a lounge fly. And it's got the little Pascal on the bottom. And the thing I love about this is the handles. So it's got like a braided handle, kind of, kind of like Rapunzel's braid. And then it's got the suns there. I love this bag so much. Rapunzel is one of my favorites. Purple is my favorite color. And it's just a beautiful bag. Absolutely stunning. And it's not like one of those in your face backpacks like I got back there, which I also love, but it's nice to have something a little different once in a while. Get the stuffing out so I can show you the inside. So the inside is the Tangled 10 Years Pattern, which is also in a couple of the other bags they have right now. Um, it does have a pocket on the inside and also a zipper pouch. So lots of storage in there. Oh, this is so awesome. I cannot wait to use this. And then it does have the strap, so you can wear it as a crossbody. Oh my god, I am so, so happy right now. Like I said, I purposely did not put a lot of items on my wish list. This was the first thing I checked. Because, like, maybe if I don't put a lot, they'll kind of understand that the bag is what I really, really want. And as always, Bibbidi nailed it. Oh my gosh. I, I'm just in awe. It's even prettier in person. And the detail is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I think I'm going to switch my purse out today and start using that one right away. Oh my god, yay! I'm so excited. I love everything. So, da 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 da, time for the packing slip. Your box was curated with love by Amanda. Oh my god, thank you, Amanda. I love everything the bag, the necklace, the shirt. Awesome. So let's go through the pricing. So the Disney licensed apparel Frozen 2 Ice Master shirt in gray was $24. Love me some crystal. The Lounge Fly Disney Tangled Flo Floating Lanterns Hardware Crossbody Bag was $75. It is beautiful. And the Lillian & Co. Rectangle Pendant Necklace 
Spaceship Earth inspired 30,000 years in rose gold it was $38, bringing the value of my box to $137. And this was a $119 box. So fantastic value for what I paid. And like I said, I love absolutely everything. Um, two of the items were on my wish list, and even the one that wasn't, I love. And I cannot wait to wear this. Uh, if you can't tell, he is one of my favorite princes. So anyway, with that being said, I should have more unboxings coming very soon. I have a uh, Mickey Loot Star Wars Entangled box. Oh, and a Monsters, Inc. I have a Be Our Guest Express Winnie the Pooh theme box coming. And from Bibbidi, I also have a Wizard's Vault and a Star Wars box from them. Um, it's kind of gonna kind of double up with the Mickey loot only because I ordered the Mickey loot back in March but they're running behind and the Bibbidi ones from April so that's all right um, never can have too much Star Wars I'm, I'm good with that and then I will also have a little bit of a mini shopping haul coming up um, I ordered pre-ordered some lounge flies I ordered some ears off some small shops and think that's oh oh and I have a new girly girl tumbler coming which I cannot wait to show you guys so keep uh, an eye out for new videos give this video a like uh, if you enjoyed it again subscribe hit the notification bell so you'll see when I have more unboxings coming up and until next time thank you all for watching bye